two, this one diamond and this one, this one to Sam. Yeah. Okay, so everything that will be 50, okay? Love that. Mm -hmm. And that one for you to offer. Can you move your hand a little bit? Okay. Hey everybody, it's Miss Philly. Oh, it's such a beautiful day out today. Oh, just a fabulous day. Things are going so amazing and I love it. Um, I woke up this morning, I weighed myself 295, 295, 290 pounds. I am like literally a pound away to be in the 280s. I am so excited and I cannot hide it. And um, I also made a lot of money reselling. I sold a super big ticket item and made some money. Nothing feels good than making money and losing weight. So everything is great. I love it. I'm just so enthusiastic and so um, extra right now. <laughs> so um, we're at Value Village. I haven't been thrifting in a while. I lost a little bit of momentum um, thrifting, uh, feeling motivated to go thrifting. But we are here because it's early Sunday morning. Um, and yeah, I hope that you guys are doing fantastic and having a great long weekend. And let's check it out inside. Okay, guys, we're at Value Village. Let's go. And check it out thank goodness they're open i wish um i wish the what is it gonna say um i wish it was warmer this long weekend that we could be at the beach but it's kind of still windy and chilly through oh is that bottega veneto probably not but we just finished looking through this whole aisle and we didn't find anything that's okay because we're positive west to me to look like bottega veneta Hey guys, it's Miss Chili. We are just coming from Save On Foods. Um, I picked up some stuff because I had a, a coupon to use, which is spend $25, get a $10 off coupon or a $10 gift card. So I want to utilize that before it expires at the end of the month. I picked up more zucchini because I'm like a big zucchini freak. All I eat is zucchini noodles with uh, fettuccine, spaghetti, peanut thai, satay sauce. So and I got a um, zucchini maker from Laura. So I love you, Laura. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And so we got zucchini. And then we picked up these chicken thighs because I'm going to actually cook a, um, uh, what do you call it? I'm going to use cauliflower rice. And then, which is just regular raw cauliflower that I shredded into rice-ish form. Um, I'm going to use half of this and I'm going to make... Um, a curry no a butter chicken <laughs> so yay for this only seven bucks for this whole pack and that can probably last me like three meals and then we and then we picked up some san pellegrino this is ten dollars a little bit expensive but they are the bigger bottles and i live for san pellegrino i actually prefer prefer it more than the perrier water um but carbonated water is carbonated water whatever there's a little bit more bougie but um, I picked this up because I go through this a lot and I find it curves the uh, pop or the um, soda cravings because it gives you that carbonated when you swallow it. So um, we picked that up. The next we picked up some Gatorade because sometimes I'm short on electrolytes and I love the Gatorade Zero. This does have five calories and one carb each bottle, which is like, uh, but... I do like Gatorade. It gives, it makes you feel a little bit more like energetic, a little bit more boost, boosted. <laughs> so we picked up the Gatorade. It's actually all that we got. <laughs> so, um, I am going to head over to uh, Peddington's and check out. They have a fifty percent off sale. Sale. So anything that's like the sale price is fifty percent off. Plus they um, also have a sale on bras. So. Um, I'm obsessed with their bras. Uh, even their $19 bras is buy one, get one free. So I want to check that out because I do have, um, right now I'm wearing this bra. It's like my favorite bra from them. 
it doesn't give you support, but it does have thicker sides, which I like. And also it, um, I wish it kind of pushed in a little bit more, but it doesn't. But I do like this for like just everyday wear and working out. So, uh, yeah. So we're going to go check out Paddington's. Hmm. Okay. Just walk in the middle of the road. <laughs> um... I haven't been craving fast food as much as I thought I would be. I mean, I do, but I don't. But I do. But I don't. Like, I don't have to have it, but I would like to have it. Um, yeah. One day, once I get into, like, a more... Uh, once I lose a lot of weight, like, a lot of weight, like, in the low 200s or even under 200, I will treat myself to some fast food and break my keep ketosis for a day or two. <laughs> Maybe, maybe on vacation. I'm really saving up for um, a turkey. I want to go to Antalya, Turkey um, because, yeah, I want to get my teeth in there. I've been watching so many videos of people going to Antalya, Turkey, and they just like, do an amazing job. And they do your teeth within five days. So you can like do like vacation slash um, surgery. Because here would be, is that? No, it's not. No, okay. <laughs> I thought it was like a high school friend of mine um yeah so that's like really on my dream list right now um is to get my teeth done in Antalya, Turkey um flights there are super expensive they're like literally twelve hundred to thirteen hundred dollars but even if you you include that amount but the thing is I'm actually only about two thousand air miles away from collecting uh enough air miles to go to Antalya, Turkey um so if my flight is covered, I only have to pay like, let's say 600 or $800 in taxes or whatever. Um, and then the cost of the procedure, let's say is 5,000 Canadian plus the hotel, let's say it's like a thousand, then spending money a thousand. So even if it's like five, six, seven, even if I spend $8,000, that is about, um, four thousand dollars cheaper than it would be to get my teeth done here because my teeth done here would not only won't be done in five days it would take like literally two weeks and then it's about a thousand dollars a tooth if I get the top row done that's ten teeth that yeah, ten teeth so that's ten thousand dollars plus the cost of anything else like whitening gum contouring whatever it's a it's like a four thousand dollar difference so I don't know I just feel like the reviews for Antalya, Turkey is way, is like super good. I love the speed of it. And also the fact that you can visit another country and like kind of, you know, experience different culture and, you know, you're by the sea. So it all works out. That's what I'm saving for. <laughs> Kids, go to Paddington's. We're at Paddington's. Oh. Um, uh, pink pins. I only bought two bras. Came up to fifty dollars. These are like my favorite bras from them. They're usually forty-five dollars a piece, so it's very like comparable to Victoria's Secret. But Victoria's Secret doesn't carry my size. Um, what I am is I have smaller breasts. Are they? I like to say looks. They're more like separated. <laughs> it's hard to explain my breasts. Okay. Um, hold on. Let's have some eye contact. Okay. Let's talk about my breasts. Okay. So my breasts um, are weirdly shaped because I'm. Well, because I'm still overweight and I was super big, um, I'm more, I have more width to me. So my width is 46, but my cup size is actually like an, a B. So bras seldom come in that size where it's wide and then small. So people like think, like designers think, if you're wide, um, you're big. So they expect you to be like a 48H or a 48D, you know, but never like a 46B. <laughs> so, um... So, um, bras are hard to find. So when I do find them, I pick them up. These are super comfortable. They don't have a wire, so they don't do a push and a, uh, a push and lift. So, but they are comfortable. I'm wearing one right now. I have it in black, um, twice in black. So now I have it like in this tan color and in 
um, white. So it's nice to have a different. And plus, once I'm losing weight, I can move it up so that, um, you know, it fits better. I love these because the side support here, like it doesn't have the fat spillage, which I love. But I don't know, I shouldn't be spending money on bras, but I am. I feel like it's summer, so I want I want to be comfortable in a bra. I don't want to like free ball. I can't believe for the longest time I never wore a bra. Like if you look at my old videos, I never wore a bra out, and I just look like a freaking mess and a half. Um. So yeah. Anyway, I think we might go to Value Village by my place. We'll see. We'll take a we'll take a gander. Hey everybody, we are at Value Village by my place. Um, we're gonna go inside and check it out see what's up we just came from Pennington's and we purchased a few bras so that's good um, <laughs> we like you um, yeah and then I have my glutathione appointment on I think it's Wednesday or Thursday so we're gonna go to that um, yeah, I don't expect to find anything inside because it's Sunday and there's literally nothing and it's long weekend and there's no production and look at my skin loving it um, I hope you guys are doing fabulous because I'm doing amazing. <laughs> There's a Danny leather bag, but there's no price on it. I don't know if this style would be sell though. Hey guys, so the only thing that we purchased from Value Village is this Danny leather bag. Um, it was only six dollars and fifty uh, thirty-five cents. So. I mean, I thought it was worth it for that price. It's a little bit of a vintage Danny leather, so the leather is a little bit better. And um, the inside is pretty clean. There's not like extremely uh, extreme wear on it. So, yeah. It has all that utilitarian look with the pockets right there. Um, yeah. Probably can get like $15. There's like that little stuff on the back, but it's like nothing major, major. And. Some people like a lot of pockets so um yeah so that's all that we got today i mean we only visited two thrift stores so what you gonna do right i'm actually gonna go donate some uh stuff so we can get a 20 percent off coupon oh don't forget to remain positive productive and progressive and i'll see you guys in tomorrow's video
So I usually donate like two bags. So to get like a 20% off coupon, um, I feel it suffice. That guy in front of me donated like literally like 10 bags <laughs> and probably just got one coupon. Um, but you gotta milk the system because Value Village likes to sting you yourself sometimes. <sighs> it's nearing 1 p.m. and I'm getting a little hungrified. So we're gonna go home and cook some. Uh, we're gonna go home and cook some curry or butter chicken with the cauliflower rice. I don't know, I feel like I wanna do OMAD, which is one meal a day. And like just eat one big meal with a caloric consummation of, I don't know what consummation, consuming uh, like 1200 calories in one meal one day, one sitting. I don't know. I feel like I'll die. That happens. I don't know. Tomorrow's like a day off, so it's holiday weekend. I don't know. One day I'm gonna have such a fierce and like awesome holiday weekend. I love I always I'm depressed. I'm not depressed this time, but I'm usually depressed like holiday weekend because I feel like people are out having fun, doing their shit, you know, and like I'm stuck at home making macaroni and cheese watching freaking Netflix. <laughs> So I want to like hang out with people and like congregate on the beach and like bonfire and barbecues and steak sausages and burgers, you know, and then like frolic on the beach, like a little hoe, and then like flirt with guys, right? <laughs> but the most important thing is that Miss Philly is working on herself and it's working, which is even more important is that it's working. Doing. Yeah, the most important thing is that the weight loss is working. Thank you, keto. Thank you, intermittent fasting. <laughs> um, I might hit the gym again. I don't know. We'll see if I hit the gym. But I'm kind of motivated to hit the gym now, just because. <laughs> anyway, guys.